So, hallo liebe Freunde der Pixelwarte. Ähm, wir sind ganz arg stolz, weil wir haben hier einen Gewinner vor uns. Dieses Spiel hat soeben auf der Gamescom einen Preis gewonnen als das beste erste Spiel. So der, like Entre what, what, what was the title of the game? Black Side. No, I mean not the title of the game, uh, the title of the prize. <laughs> uh, the prize? Yeah. Oh yeah, so what? Uh, it's the best adventure game of the Gamescom 2000. Best entered? Adventure. Best adventure game. Bestes Abenteuerspiel auf der Gamescom. Ich bin heilfroh, dass wir hier sein dürfen, weil es ist unser zweites Interview. Wir waren ja die ersten. Nicht hat ja außer uns keiner darüber berichtet, über dieses richtig geile Spiel. Und wir haben jetzt Olivier an unserer Seite, der uns ein bisschen mehr dazu erzählen kann, was wir letztes Mal alles nicht erzählen durften. Pia spielt es ein bisschen. Wir werden Pia danach mal kurz noch mal fragen, wie es für sie war. Aber ich kann euch jetzt schon sagen, es ist ein geiles Spiel. Das kommt raus für die Switch, für die Playstation und für die Xbox One. Und ihr habt richtig gesehen, es kommt auch noch in der Collectors Edition mit so einer wunderbaren Figur die extrem liebevoll und detailliert gemacht ist, zusammen mit Limited Edition Karten. Das Ganze basiert auf einem Comic, aber Olivier wird uns jetzt dazu mehr erzählen und das übergebe ich jetzt. Olivier, my, my, you might introduce yourself and just tell us why we're here and what we're doing. Hi, uh, so I'm uh, Oliver, I'm a uh, brand manager on Blackside and the Skin. Uh, the game will be released on uh, November 5th for yeah. all platforms, including PC that we haven't shared, uh -huh. unfortunately. Cool. Uh, coming in a uh, true version at release, a limited edition, mm -hmm. uh, with uh, four lithographs and uh, one uh, anti-color image. Mm -hmm. And uh, the collector edition, all for the four platforms, mm -hmm. with the limited edition, plus the figurine and uh, the portfolio. How long did it take you and uh, how do you feel now? Uh, really nice, <laughs> because uh, seeing the results as a finished product, it's really uh, quite a cheap, I think. Uh -huh. And uh, yeah, it's really, really great to see, it. to have them, to touch them. The team behind the comic series, how do they feel? Uh, it's a little bit strange, actually, because we ask them the same question. Uh -huh. uh, how does it feel to see your character uh, animated in 3D? They are quite thrilled actually, cool. because uh, yeah, you can imagine that uh, you have pictures, you have an idea of the voice yeah. and uh, of the movement, and uh, seeing yeah. seeing blacks that moves and talk, actually, they, uh, they, I must precise that uh, they were already involved in the whole process uh -huh. of validation, uh -huh. but uh, they are quite happy with uh, the work that was done and uh, the voice acting, for instance. Yeah. They said it was uh, perfectly what they in mind. Wow. So, yeah, really good. It's thrilled about uh, this game. Graphic novels don't, don't, don't usually don't speak so yeah. much. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, in this case, it's quite honorable that a day who couldn't provide a voice suddenly found your voice. I mean, not your voice, but from your uh, support, the voice uh, in the game. Um, for me, it's a bit like the wonder that happened to, to The Walking Dead, because when you compare it, there was also a great a highly developed um, um, graphic novel that went into a, a huge IP. Yeah, I see actually the same way here. Yeah, I see the, the graphic content, but not with humans, with animals. So the first question I really have, because we couldn't precise it last time, it was we were too excited about it. Why you took um, these characters? Why you think animals are n not only because of the of the graphic novel, but why you think animals are the better humans for this game? Uh, actually, and I will uh, think, I think I will quote the author. Uh, what is interesting is uh, animal in this universe actually acts uh, depending on the uh, what they are actually. Mm -hmm. for, for instance, this rhino uh, will find out later that he is a bodyguard. A bodyguard. Because, uh, it's logical because he is big mm -hmm. and stuff, and uh, he will fight with uh, his sword, which uh, better suited for killing or defending his boss. Okay. You know? So every animal actually a uh, depiction of uh, the mind of the people. All right. So that's why maybe Blackside is, uh, is a detective because he's swift and agile, uh -huh. and uh, as in the game, he has uh, improved uh, senses, uh -huh. uh, improved uh, hearing, improved uh -huh. smelling and sight. Uh -huh. So you will be able to use these senses during the game yeah. to look out for clues in a way that other animals or the character couldn't. Mm -hmm. So that's what is really interesting in the in the game, but also in the novel. It's having all this uh, different type of uh, character. Understand. Uh, um, now we can see a bit more of the of the actually the, the narrative that happens be, be between me, the, the, the player and uh, the, the, what, what the content and the story that's happening. Um, I would really like to see the, the skill uh, level in, in the thinking. Yeah? I would like to hear a bit more uh, about that. Um, um, wh wh who, who had this 
marvelous idea to combine thoughts, or maybe you just talk about, just tell us what, what we are going to expect. Uh, so you are, you are going to see most of the features in this game since it's uh, starting right at the beginning. Mm -hmm. yeah? So you will see quick time events, that's uh, right here. Uh, let's say that just after that, if uh, we succeed to complete the quick time events, we'll yeah. see multi choice dialogues yeah. and uh, add more choice. Uh, and the choices actually uh, impact the, the endings yeah. and uh, your relationship with the characters. For instance, uh, if you choose to betray someone, he will remember that and uh, maybe, maybe they, uh, wow. Make you pay later. Wow. Um, maybe if you give him, uh, make him favor, he will uh, owe you one, so maybe help you. Okay. Uh, what we'll be expecting also is uh, so the cutscenes during uh, investigation phases. How many cutscenes are there? In this no, three. Uh, How many? Three. Sorry. Three cutscenes. Uh, cutscenes. No, I mean uh, cutscenes. Cutscenes. No, I know. Three cutscenes. Okay. Uh, okay. 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 Uh, cutscenes. Uh, uh, so sight, uh, smelling, and uh, hearing. I will just help uh, my fear. Sorry. Actually, uh, you have to wait for the white circle to shrink, and you have a gray area, oh. and you need to press when the white circle is in uh, this area. But I can uh, tell you when to press it. It will be easier. <laughs> okay. Maybe maybe you uh, you press it with her. Also, wir sind gerade in der Mitte des Anfanges. Ja, wir wollen ja jetzt auch nicht so viel spoilern, aber das dürfen wir euch verraten. Nicht hier muss man sich richtig verhalten, damit man nicht aus Versehen ähm, entweder ermordet wird oder eben aus dem Fenster fliegt. Ne? Und äh, diese Auseinandersetzung zeigt eigentlich schon, wie tief dieses Spiel geht, nicht? weil es hat natürlich eine gewisse, ähm, äh, wie soll ich sagen, Physis. Ne? Es ist sehr brutal. Ne? Also das kann man schon sagen. Das ist auch kein Spiel für Kinder. Das ist ein Spiel für Erwachsene. Nicht? Und obwohl es in diesem kindlichen, könnte man fast sagen, Universum spielt, ist es halt wirklich äh, ein ernster Titel, der sich mit, sage ich mal, auch realen Begebenheiten beschäftigt. It's, it's actually uh, um, so close to a real time, it it's play, plays in the 50s, right? Yeah. yeah. It's uh, setting is in the 50s and the story actually starts uh, revolves around the sporting scene in New York in the 50s. Mm -hmm. So for a short story, uh, Black Sad here will be hired by uh, Sun Eden. Her uh, father killed himself, and uh, the famous uh, boxer from the, uh, his mm -hmm. gym mm -hmm. disappeared just before a big fight at Madison Square Garden. Mm -hmm. So they will have to pay a fine if uh, he is no, no show, mm -hmm. they say, mm -hmm. and it will mean the end of uh, the gym. Okay. So Sonia wanting to perpetuate her father's legacy wants uh, Black Sad to find Marshall, the missing mm -hmm. boxer. Okay. So this is the, the actually this is also in the comic in the uh, graphic novels. This is the start of this saga. No, uh, this story is 100% exclusive to the game. Ah. So it's is uh, set between the first and the second uh, comic book. Okay. And uh, if you don't know about Black Sand, that's perfect because uh, you can play it even if you don't know the comics. Wow, cool. And if you know the comics, that's even better because you will find here and there a few references, sorry, a few references yeah. to, to the comics. Wow, that's cool, that's yeah. amazing. So that's people cool. might not know that there is yeah. a, a huge comic already going on, a huge graphic novel. Yeah. yeah, that was famous, very famous. Yeah. yeah. They started in the 70s. Or? Uh, I think they started in the. Two thousands. Uh, in the two thousands? Yeah, yeah, it's quite young. Yeah, yeah, wow. But yeah, the way it was, uh, was uh, acclaimed. Uh -huh. oh, sorry, in France, in Spain, uh, actually, yeah, we saw this is a perfect setting for a game. And uh, actually, the author was thinking about uh, an adaptation uh -huh. of the graphic novel. But they didn't know if it was uh, going to be a movie, a video game. And since uh, Dargo actually is a publisher of mm -hmm. uh, the in France, mm -hmm. is uh, the same group as uh, we are. Okay. This is a nice and perfect, perfect way. To perfect to match. Because yeah. match. Yeah. I see you have uh, all kind of IPs that deal actually with with very highly anticipated worldwide yes. franchises like Asterix and Obelix. Yeah. yeah. I mean, this is like uh, yeah, also this firm sozusagen. Uh, nimmt nicht nur die grafischen Novellen, die Comics, sondern macht daraus eben auch richtig tolle Spiele, nicht Identifikationsmöglichkeiten, Asterix und Obelix habe ich gerade gesagt, nicht Black Side ist sozusagen so ein bisschen Indie, aber eigentlich nicht, in Frankreich ist es ein sehr bekanntes Comic und äh, hier in Deutschland wird es sicherlich auch seinen Weg gehen, nicht wie gesagt, jetzt auf der Gamescom ausgezeichnet als bestes Adventure-Spiel, 
Um, ich würde wahnsinnig gerne noch ein bisschen was. There's a skill tree. Are you develop also skills like in the RPG? No, no, no. There's no uh, skill tree. In this okay. One. Uh, what uh, what should we finding? Uh, so is a deduction game, what mm -hmm. we call it. So all the clues that you are going to gather yeah. in your, uh, your adventure, mm -hmm. you have to combine the clues to make like the, a mind map. Yeah, I saw, yeah, yeah. So yeah, to make the investigation progress. Yeah. You can't guess wrong actually. You can go on a false path, but uh, yeah, you you can make wrong assumption. Yeah. Because the game wants you to make wrong assumption. But and, a good uh, one, or you can also make a false one. You can't make a false one in terms of. Uh, okay, so you want to have a different uh, outcome, uh -huh. actually. But the game, in the way that the detective is thinking, makes you might uh, make you make false assumption mm -hmm. because you think that it might be a good lead. But while you will be digging a little more, you will find out that uh, you were wrong actually. Or oh. Blackstar was wrong. Okay. So he's not omniscient. And uh, actually, he, he has a notebook as uh, every good detective where mm -hmm. he's writing every clue and everything he finds. And that's what is interesting. It's not like in a menu. Uh, while he's investigating, he will uh, close some of uh, some, uh, his uh, leads, okay. this kind of thing. So it mm -hmm. will update in a very visual way. Okay, in his, in his uh, uh, in your notebook. In his notebook, right? Yeah. 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 Wow, cool. Yeah. And uh, he keeps the tracks of all the people he met. So okay. Yeah. So, um, I mean, because of the false outcoming, I mean, the false uh, being detective, because I, I might be not so the clever detective like he is. Um, how, how do you, um, how, how do you, oh, sorry, how do you do your progress in this? I mean, um, how, how can you progress, or if you go the wrong path, what happens when you, you return? Yeah, actually, yeah, you can go uh, a wrong path. Mm -hmm. uh, that's why, uh, what can I explain? Uh, you have to follow kind of uh, this deduction, mm -hmm. but because the game wants you to make this deduction, yeah. but actually the whole uh, thing is uh, the right thing. And I think it's one of the main strengths of the game, it's uh, racing that was put in Maxan. So, for now, uh, when you are hired, you may think it's a uh, quite simple uh, investigation, I must just find a missing uh, missing man. Mm -hmm. But while you will be digging for, for clues and everything, you will find out that there is a little more than uh, maybe a missing man. Okay. Yeah, this one. Ah. And that's what is interesting and why I'm uh, telling you about uh, false places ah. like for Blackstar in the game. Okay. So, the, yeah. so you have to be really exploring the area, you have to find yeah, yeah, yeah. all kinds of details yeah. that bring you to, to a new assumption. Yeah. And uh, this way, Blackstar will be able to advance. Okay. And uh, so you will meet uh, people, maybe accuse people, and uh, they will be uh, defending themselves. Uh -huh. So you will get uh, new clues. Yeah. And uh, yeah, the investigation will go, uh, can I say, uh, deeper and deeper in, uh, in New York's uh, underground. But what is the assumption for the length of the game? I'm going to, uh, as a bad detective, as a good detective. Um, it's not. Uh, I don't want to say uh, to, uh, you to have a uh, false idea of the game. Uh, you are forced to follow the tracks okay. in a way. Yeah. But you have also your characters that will be evolving mm -hmm. in a meaningful way according to your choices. Yeah, that's what I thought, yeah. Yeah. So um, actually, I could show you the, the game menu. Later. Yeah, it would be great, yeah. And uh, maybe it's here. And uh, this is uh, the feature called Dual Black Sun. And according to the choices you make, ah. your character will have different... Uh, That's what I meant with the skill tree. So there is a skill tree, I it's see. It's not like a skill tree because you don't have different skills, but you have a different uh, dialogue options, yeah, but it's great. different uh, interaction with other characters. Wow. Lonesome, romantic. It's yeah. really cool. Wow. It's, really sad. it's so character-driven. It's, it's yeah. really interesting. Wow. And uh, as uh, the rate of uh, Pandolo Saint during uh, making of me, Maybe the game is not about uh, cracking the case, but uh, maybe the game is about finding out what kind of viewer you want to be. Wow, wow, that's cool. And I think the, yeah, it was quite a good uh, sum up of uh, the policy uh -huh. And the part to the switch, uh, why, why, why to the switch? Uh, what was the idea behind? Because uh, it, it's, 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 it's a totally new, new, new game and uh, yeah. suddenly it's on the switch. But we want every player to experience uh, the game actually, uh -huh. and uh, so if there is an audience in the Switch, and um, 
You may say that Nintendo was making uh, games that were more, more uh, greater, more family oriented. Yeah. Yeah. But no, they are open to this kind of audience and so yeah. more, more dark uh, experience. It's wonderful. Yeah. It's wonderful. So why not? Because I play on the Switch, you know, I can't afford, uh, because I don't have so much time to sit on the PC or to sit on the console, but this, when you're on a train, when you're yeah, on a business exactly. trip, this is the crime story to read or yeah. to interact with Yeah, on the Switch, which makes it really uh, very, very nice. Yeah, I can't wait actually to play and that. since you have your notebook, even if you like uh, put the game away for, let's say, uh, one day or two, because you are doing something and you are playing on the yeah. Switch yeah. during uh, when you commute or something, yeah. well, you can just uh, open the game again, go to your notebook, see where you were in your investigation, what you were doing and what was... Uh, the character, uh, the characters, all the characters uh, telling you, uh -huh. and so you can just look in again in the game. Jump back yeah, again. Yeah, jump cool. Back again. Yeah. And how does the community of, of Black Side react to that? How 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 is the how are they? How is the anticipation of that? Um, I think with uh, no the first trailer, uh, they have a picture ID. When the first uh, pictures, uh, first images were released, uh, they were uh, a bit worried about mm -hmm. the fact that. Uh, there was not this uh, touch of the drawing of uh, Guarnido. Mm -hmm. But actually, we wanted to explore uh, also another media than the graphic novel. Mm -hmm. So, another media could also mean another uh, kind of uh, graphic drawing. Mm -hmm. This is also true because uh, in a graphic novel, you have uh, 48 pages mm -hmm. and uh, you have to go for uh, stories uh, more maybe in a more condensed way. In a linear way. Yeah, yeah. and in a video game, you have. Uh, all the time you want to develop the, the adventure and the uh -huh. story. Uh -huh. So this is a different media. Uh, Black Set fans must think about that. What do they like most about uh, this franchise? Is it uh, the drawing or Black Set? All uh, right, uh, yeah. The, the mood, uh, I think it's it. the character. The characters, because actually, why, why are we here? I, I was outside. I was looking uh, around uh, all the booths, yeah, and I suddenly saw this amazing painting on your wall outside yeah this graphic and I just thought this is a intriguing character not the the painting the graphic the, yeah. the, it was not the graphic it was the way he was standing and you immediately felt if this uh, okay there's something important because this guy is serious he's thinking about something very serious so it must be something very important so let me find out yeah. this is really important yeah and this is why we came here and it was uh, we were touched by both yeah, yeah. by this uh, but, but actually the way he was standing, why he was presenting his inner feelings and... Well, what we could say to, uh, to Black Sabbath fans actually, it's uh, the character himself is uh, faithful to the one in the comics. Okay. He will have this kind of uh, serious guy, uh, hardball detective, yeah. but also this uh, kind of uh, humor touch he has in comics. Yeah. Uh, through narration in the graphic novel, but yeah. also through uh, discussion with the other characters. We will also see some dark sides of Black Sad? Yeah. We will. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Black Sad, uh, you can decide uh, who he is through the game. Okay. This kind of uh, strange because if you have a uh, graphic novel, he has already uh, maybe a personality. Yeah. But maybe it's not explore that deep in graphic novels. In the in the game, it's your hero, and uh, so you can uh, really decide who he is. Are you drinking or are you okay. pretending to drink? Okay. To, be the stereotype of a uh, detective. Uh, will you be touched because someone has no money for a case, yeah. but so really need your wealth, or will you just uh, yeah. wow. push your hand because uh, wow. no, I don't want the case, you can pay me. So that's yeah, really your choice. Wow, wow, interesting. And this will has uh, will have also an effect later in, in the development of the game. Yeah. Wow. Cool. So, yeah. Uh, there are few few endings. Uh -huh. a version of uh, the endings. And uh, for me, we have really some endings that are really, really different and really differ uh, from the, from the wow. case resolution. Wonderful. But I can't say too much. Oh, no, no, no. You, I said, you already said everything that, that's important for me because I really want to play it and I can, as I said, I can't wait to dive into to a, a character that actually touched me by his presentation. But uh, as I said, it was both. Yeah, It was the, the way it was shown, it was presented, because that was the cover. and. Uh, I, I, I think it's also, I think it's time for these kind of heroes, you know, because yeah. they, they don't need to be automatically broken, but it's so good if they show sides, because the stereotypes of, 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 of uh, uh, detectives, all these 
CSI or this uh, series that we have on TV, high tech, polished guys, you know, clean, everything is perfect, they don't have any issues. It's hard to identify with because we are human. Yeah. And to identify with a panther that has a, a certain mindset with a higher quality of, of, of investigation, I think that's really cool and uh, I can't wait, as I said, to play it. But uh, again, yeah, it's a very mature, uh, mature game and mature universe. Uh -huh. So uh, yeah, you can see, for instance, in the racing and the, in the gym room mm -hmm. here. Uh, yeah, you have to be prepared because uh, this is kind of a uh, very Wow. Yeah, yeah, it's a new graphic novel. Yeah, yeah. but uh, to, to also speak out for for the parents that now uh, re refer to the comic, to the graphic novel, um, it's, it's, I think it's good to tell them what, what kind of age you would recommend to play that game. Well, for the US, for instance, we are rated M, mm -hmm. so this has to be expected. M because of uh, strong language and yeah. really strong language. Yeah. Uh, for instance, there uh, are racial uh, issues in this world mm -hmm. because this is a representation of our world in the 50s. Mm -hmm. So we are not, um, say, uh, putting these uh, issues away like it never existed. Yeah. It was during the 50s, yeah. so it is in the game. Uh, so there's uh, gun usage, uh, control. It's like 15, 16, it's, it's at least two. They have the mindset 17, to be prepared. 18, 17, 18, 18 that's yeah. what you say. Cool. Yeah. Also, Leute, dran denken, das ist, no? Because I remember. Sorry. That's cool, that's cool. You're fine. Um, I remember um, Pan, uh, uh, what is it? Pan, not Pan's Legend. That was this, this great Del Toro production. Pan's Labyrinth, you yeah, remember? Yeah. Everybody thought because it's Peter Pan or yeah. some Pan, everybody thought it's a nice, nice story. Actually, it dealt with uh, Spain, with the Spanish uh, 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 terror uh, in, in a certain time, and uh, people were shocked by that. And uh, I just want to make sure that this is taken seriously because it can't be a, a mistake by the user. It should be clear that this is a really grown-up game for grown-up people who want to immerse in a totally new environment with a new story with a new character and not uh, and, and still can wait for for the moments that they know from noir crime because that's that's the darkest crime story at all yeah but the presentation is so intriguing it's so wonderful lightning the colors everything it's, it's well, of course you don't have some because uh, have the headphones, but all the, also music is really important to the game. Okay. Uh, since Black Sun, in the comics, you can see him uh, go to uh, jazz bars and everything. Okay. We, we went to uh, really jazzy soundtracks, uh -huh. and uh, we decided, except for the main team, the main team must uh, like be a, a break from uh, the jazz. Uh, it's jazz a composition for the, for the game. So, for the main team, it's by uh, Inazzo. We worked with him on uh, Survivor 3, okay. so we are already okay with uh, this kind of work. And we told him it must not be Jay-Z, it must be like the uh, most intriguing and uh, like, yeah, this kind of uh, dark. Yeah, the huge song. crime yeah. thing. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. But during the game, even the music is important because it's uh, dynamic music. And according to your action and uh, what you are going to do, uh, the music will change. So there will be also like original music from the 50s? You license uh, for that? Or? No, not from the 50s. It's an uh, original composition for the game. Okay. Uh, but it stains uh, yeah, this kind of uh, Feeling jazz, jazz, jazz atmosphere. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, maybe we have the opportunity next year to have an interview with a musician, you know? <laughs> yeah. Would be great because I, I like it because it's actually the other 50% of a game or of a film, yeah, yeah. you always have to keep in mind the soundtrack. It's so, I'm so happy that you mentioned it because I always forget yeah, that this is a cinematic uh, production in the end, you know, and it's an interactive movie with a high quality and uh, we have music there, we have a sound, yeah. I guess the sound work was uh, because of fur, you know, you have fur. It's a different kind of sound design than a human detective. Huh? Uh, even when, uh, for instance, Black Sad at the beginning is uh, eating the rhino, it can make it can't make actually a sound of uh, a human eating uh, flesh. Yeah. So you have more of this uh, rocky sound uh, when eating uh, the horn actually. Cool. Uh, yeah. So yeah, this also this kind of uh, some detail. Yeah. But maybe we should re uh, remove the option to uh, to remove the music because uh, it doesn't have uh, any specification to remove the music from the game. Yeah.
so massive and uh, it's yeah. part of the game. Yeah. Yeah. Aber so, das werdet ihr alles herausfinden, weil wir können das hier leider nicht im Moment präsentieren. Ich wollte, ich könnte die Musik und die Soundtrack zeigen, aber wir können euch im Moment nur Bilder zeigen. Um, shall we stop now or it's okay when, when she continues? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. We okay. can continue. Cool, okay. So as you want. Because uh, I just, uh, uh, for, for the last question, when this is going to be released and um, what, what, uh, what, what, uh, is, what comes after that? What, what, you have already something in mind for a second part or something, I don't know? So uh, the game is uh, releasing uh, November 5th okay. uh, for our platforms again. Uh -huh. And uh, of course we have in mind uh, maybe another Black Side game according to the tactical response. Okay. Of course. DLC, 